With investment property, you have two other people to help you make the payments. The tenant who pays you rent and the tax man who contributes via giving you a much bigger tax return. It is called negative gearing and here's how it works. Let's start with that $500,000 property you bought with none of your own cash. And let's assume your taxable income is $100,000 per year. Your tenant will rent the property for $420 per week, which equates to $21,000 in annual rental income. Using a standard interest rate of 4.5% for your loans and rental expense, such as property management, rates, insurance, body corporate, etc., your total annual cash rental and interest expenses are $28,000. That results in a negative of $7,000 per year. So far, not looking all that great, but wait, here comes the tax man. With a newly built property, you can claim depreciation expense for the building and fixtures of the property. This is a non-cash deduction, meaning it doesn't affect your wallet. And for your $500,000 property, this ends up being close to $11,500 per year. So the total deductions you're claiming is now $39,500 for your first year. Now, let's see what the tax man really does for you. At your current income of $100,000, your annual taxes are $26,950. But now you own this investment property that is generating rental income, so your total income now goes up to $121,000. But let's not forget about those expenses. Subtract your total deductions of $39,500 and your taxable income now is $81,500, where the tax payable is only $19,850. This means that you have generated a negative gearing tax credit of $7,100. So how does this credit help you? Well, let's go back to that rental income of $21,000 and the total annual cash expenses of $28,000, leaving you with a negative $7,000 per year. Now, with your tax credit of $7,100, you are actually earning a positive cash flow of $100 per year. Or more simply, you will be earning $2 per week to own this $500,000 property. As you can see, this is very different to making repayments on a $500,000 mortgage on your own home, where you get no assistance from the tenant or the tax man. But for many people, there still remains one huge question, what to buy and where to buy it. This often is the biggest question because not all properties perform well. We have another video in our series exactly on this topic will show you that it's possible and achievable to use research to massively reduce the risk of mistakenly buying the wrong type of property in the wrong location, or even worse, paying too much for it. If you are serious about your next investment property having little or no impact on your household cash flow, as well as delivering great capital growth, please give us a call.